and breaking you straight to this big story that we are tracking at this moment which is coming in from Thane these visuals are of the railway station in Thane where since morning thousands of protesters especially angry parents uh, had uh, completely blockaded they were on these railway tracks that you are seeing at this moment and uh, just a short while back this is in protest against molestation of two young children, four-year-old in a school. The parents were quite angry. Since morning, there were ministers, police officials coming in. Finally, the police, in fact, losing their patience and they decided to clear the tracks of these people. As you can see, the police lati charging, using some force and pushing people away as far as these tracks are concerned. Or from the other side, remember, these are railway uh, tracks. So what is happening at this moment is that uh, from the railway track, people are picking up stones and there is stone pelting which is going on without any further delay. Let me take you to my colleague uh, Anuj who is joining us at this moment. Uh, Anuj is at the very railway station where this entire drama is unfolding. Anuj, uh, stone pelting still going on. Stay safe but just give our viewers a sense of what is happening at this moment. Yes, stone pelting is still going on. We see that the protests here, the protesters had basically taken over this entire track. I'll just ask uh, my cameraman, uh, Hemant, to zoom into it. You can see this, this entire track was filled with people in the last, since the last eight hours. Uh, practically blocking the movement of the central railway towards this extremely important station of Badlapur here in Thane. And the police were here since the morning. There were several police, uh, you know, senior police officials who were present here who tried to woo the people, who tried to appeal to the people and tell them that, uh, any, the, that the action will be initiated against the protesters. Besides that, we saw several government representatives come here as well, including senior minister Girish Mahajan, who told them that the best they could do is to suspend the people in involved to make sure that the police officials who are involved in basically dealing the case, the action is taken against them as well and fast tracking the case. All of these things were told to the protesters but they were not ready to move. In fact, as the day went on, they were all, the protest was becoming more intense and uh, the number of people occupying the track was also increasing. The police is, police are of the opinion that they had no other option uh, rather, that, rather than, uh, you know, lati charging at the protesters because according to them, uh, a lot of time had been given to them and we see that just when we were talking to the protesters here, the police started lati charging and when they started Lati charging, it took more than 10 to 15 seconds for this entire crowd to leave this place. And after that, we saw that stones and chapels being pelted towards the towards the uh, uh, towards the police officers. We can see that there are some stones here on the platform, uh, and then we can also see that there is some uh, some public property which was also attacked by the by the uh, protesters here. Uh, all the stuff that you can see either on the tracks or on the platform is basically chapels which have been thrown towards the police or the stones which were pelted uh, which were pelted at the police. Now the police is still quite vigilant here on the tracks here on the platform because uh, they fear that the protesters might still return because we saw what happened in the morning when the protesters made their way through to the school. They, you know, uh, tear gas was, uh, which was put in the public by the police was thrown back at the police and we saw stone pelting happen against the police people as well. And now it is the second peak hour, the trains, the train had to start. We saw senior ministers tell that the system, the train system cannot function if this important track or station is closed, which is why enough reassurances were given to them in oral sense according to the administration but nothing was enough for the protesters to leave this place which is why the last resort of the police officials present here was lati charge and that is indeed what they came down to here at the badlapur railway station yeah you know anuj we can see these uh, visuals still the, you know the situation uh, massive police presence there as well 10 express trains were diverted because of uh, what was happening uh, since morning. Anuj, can I request you and your camera person if it is only safe to move towards those visuals where you we saw, uh, you know, in the commotion where people had uh, the slippers and the stones were pelted, just to get a sense at this moment of how uh, this entire situation, the chaos erupted when the police despite repeated requests in fact uh, the the protesters were not ready to in fact leave oh let's just listen in uh, to one of the reactions which is coming in at this moment from the senior police officials <laughs> Let's go, 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 let's go
So that's, uh, the, in fact, the media trying to get a reaction out of the senior police officials at the uh, spot, uh, not willing to speak. Remember, since morning, this is this, this what you're seeing right now, just happened a few moments back. And this after, since morning, uh, there were protesters, in fact, at this moment. Uh, look at this, the police had to, in fact, uh, indulge. Uh, these are the live visuals which we are getting uh, at this moment. Uh, uh, and uh, where the police, in fact, is trying to move people, few of them have been injured. So you can see uh, in this whole commotion, somebody who has been injured being picked up and taken away. This entire platform, ladies and gentlemen, uh, was, in fact, uh, covered with people. There were a lot of people protesting, angry after what had happened. And uh, the story coming in from Badlapur in Thane will anger any parent. In fact, it will anger any right-minded individual. Uh, but, of course, as uh, the police have been saying, the government has been saying that the uh, tracks cannot be on hostage, uh, on hold for, uh, you know, for long. The demands have been met is what the police is saying. Uh, there were a lot of women uh, also among the protesters. Anuj, if may, I may come back to you. We can see, uh, you know, in these visuals, few uh, people, those who have been injured, uh, you know, uh, uh, also being taken away. These are shots a short while back, stone pelting from the other side. And, uh, uh, in fact, uh, police are pushing people away. At this moment, the platforms are cleared. Uh, what's the situation outside the railway station? Because there were a lot of people outside the railway station and outside that school as well. Yes. Yes, yes. The platforms are clear as of now. In the last 10 minutes, as we've been reporting, uh, the moment the Lati charge began, the platforms were made clear. We see this middle platform right here, the central platform. This is where the maximum police was here so that they can counter the protesters, throwing stones at them either from the right side or from the left side. But after giving them a time of close to 5 to 10 minutes, we can see that the police now have started to disperse themselves outside the platform just to make sure that there are no protesters waiting there with stones or chapels. Which is why we can see that the police is, is slowly being seen, you know, moved from this place. They are trying to talk to every single person they are able to find here. They are, they are questioning every single person that they are finding here. These, many of these people, they are not necessarily protesters. They are not necessarily... क्या वो इसने पत्थर पेका था क्या सर पत्थर पेका था आपने नहीं नहीं पेका था है पत्थर पेका था आपने so we're seeing that many of these we're seeing that a lot of people who are so we can see we can see that a lot of these stones which were thrown towards the police uh, were, were probably from the people who were sitting there right outside the station and the police is making sure that no one is occupying this place, that place now. Of course, there's a lot of uncertainty about who threw the stones because they did, the crowd did not have a face. The crowd did not have any sort of personification or physical representation. There were a lot of people who were taking action, which was quite impulsive. But the police does not want to take any chance. They are trying to make sure that the, not just the platform, but even the area around the platform is cleared of the public so that uh, the railway can start here at the Badlapur station. As we've been saying it time and again, this is an extremely important railway station here in the Thane region of the state where a lot of people travel from on a daily basis in the morning and in the evening. Uh, you see that thousands of people travel from this railway station. This, of course, falls in the central line. They travel from this railway station on an hourly basis. Thousands of people on an hourly basis. So, of course, the fact that this railway line was, uh, this particular railway station was blocked by the protesters for the last eight hours means a lot, means that a lot of diversions took place, a lot of discrepancy kind of came in, which is why we are seeing that uh, the police is trying to make sure that the normalcy is being brought in place. I would also like to zoom towards the kind of pub damage that happened to the public property, be it the benches uh, or be it the stairs. Many of these things were attacked by the angry mob, uh, which was lati charged by the police. Now we are seeing that the police is, is basically distributing itself across this region and uh, trying to catch hold of anyone who was seen on the station uh, at, at, the, at the station or at the platforms when the lati charge happened just to make sure that they are kept away from the railway station at this very moment. However, it has been close to 10 to 15 minutes since the Lati charge happened. The police is still very vigilant because from what we've been seeing in, since the morning, Lati charge can happen at any time and the impact 
is quite unknown at the moment Anuj, for the police. Anuj, you know, uh, what we, uh, when you were, in fact, describing the situation around you, we saw some, uh, uh, the policemen entering some houses right opposite to the railway station. Uh, do they suspect that there were people from those rooftops trying to, in fact, pelt stones? Because we saw the police banging on some uh, houses uh, right, exactly where you are pointing out uh, right now. Uh, the yeah. police inside. Yeah. So are these houses, commercial yeah. establishment? Just give our viewers a sense of why the police is, in fact, in these buildings which are, uh, you know, uh, adjoining the railway station. Now you see that uh, a lot of places around the railway station are usually commercial, are usually commercial places, especially here in Mumbai. Uh, they are either sweet shops or some other sort of uh, eateries. Uh, but then when the police started uh, lati charging, uh, you know, uh, very heavily, the protesters tried to take whatever shelter they could take because the lati charge was quite heavy, unlike what was the case in the morning. In the morning, we saw that the police being a little uh, considerate towards the, uh, towards the people, uh, considering the emotions were very high. But what happened here 15 minutes ago was way more violent from the police side as well when it comes uh, to towards the uh, as far as the uh, protesters are concerned as well and you can see uh, towards the place where my camera person is zooming at the moment these and places like these which were open the moment the lati charge happened many protesters tried to try to you know occupy these places just to make sure that they were kept safe but as you rightly said the police is now after letting go of 10 or 15 minutes when realizing that there is no immediate uh, stone pelting that is happening here at the moment they are going and checking these places if anyone is ready with the stones because the stone pelting was quite unexpected. The moment the protesters were lati charged, the first layer of the protesters which stepped out of the railway station picked up whatever they had and, uh, and tried to throw at, towards the police. Now, as you can again see that there are a lot of these people who are being caught by the police. Now, we again don't necessarily know if these were the people who were involved in lati charging, but they took shelters close to the, uh, close to the railway station as a result of which, uh, as, a, as a security or as a precautionary measure, the police is trying and keep them with them at least for a while so that uh, any sort of risk is uh, is averted at the moment here from the police